All right, welcome back to the third part of the Cowboy Tarantula. So what I'm going to do is draw in some more attire to the character, maybe like a poncho. And I'm going to have it come like right, right around here. Yeah. We'll go here. Kind of like that. And then... We'll have it go up a little bit like this. Hmm, this is going to be a little difficult, isn't it? <laughs> oh, geez. All right, so we're going to go ahead and just have it hang it down. I like that. I'm going to go ahead and raise. What we have here, get rid of some of this mane. <laughs> All right, have it swirled around like around here, going behind the pedipalp and the head. Erase this in between. I'm going to have this like here. We'll have it like coming down here. Hmm. It's a little bit of a challenge. It'd be so much easier if it was a human figure, but it's not. All right. I tell you what, we'll go this way. Kind of like that. Kind of like that. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and raise what's here and we'll try to draw those folds and everything and give that poncho more detail and that way it'll give the um, the image a more western look so here we go Have it coming down this way. It's my first time drawing an animal in a human role, so bear with me. <laughs> All right, there we go. Like that. Go ahead and erase this line. I screwed up there. <laughs> erase some of this leg here because the poncho is obscuring it. folds here have these cut across at the top here and this coming down this way there we go we'll go ahead and draw this like around here we'll get rid of this um, leg that's showing on the poncho it doesn't belong there Okay. 
Okay, great. <laughs> All right. So we got this, got the clothing. We have a good semblance of a poncho here. That is covering the upper left side to the bottom side of the character, which is what we want. There we go. All right, so we got that. Now, my next goal, I guess to um, draw in a semblance of a vest, I think that would, that would work out. Let's go this way. Like that. I erase some for body, his body rather. This turned out better than I anticipated, I'll say that. Then um, we'll show that it's kind of buttoned up right around here. So we'll bring this side of the vest in closer. There we go. There we go. All right. Uh, the belt buckle. We'll go right here. Races in between. Well, we could have that. Why don't we just give it more of a Western feel? If we just go ahead and draw this belt, um, slanted, like starting starting from the like starting from the left side here, and then just. Going off to the right, kind of like that. Okay, perfect. Another belt in the back here. Okay, we could draw the belt buckle. Right, right, right there. Okay. Go. Draw more darken this abdomen a little bit. There we go. We could draw like a second belt. Could just probably bring this vest down through this. We could bring it down, obscuring the first belt like that. Since cowboys in these old Western films are unkempt and disheveled. There we go. Do the same thing here. There we go. Okay. As for the other belt, we'll just have it coming down right here. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to work. Yeah. So we're going from the cephalothorax to the belt to the abdomen.
Okay, so we got the second belt. We'll go ahead and draw the belt buckle, more like right here, disappearing into the vest, like right there. So let's go ahead and erase this one line that's on the belt. You could draw the belt, belt itself a little thinner. Now we're going to go ahead and draw a gun holster. So I'm thinking about having it right here. And, um, but I'm also having conflicts about having it elsewhere. So um, I'm not sure which, where, which way to go. Um, We could go right here. It's not going to be easy to do. Like right there. Hope this camera is still rolling. I just saw a red flash. We'll have the gun holder right, right, right there. We could probably have it a little straighter than that. Of this Looked around that way. There we go. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and um, darken up the legs a little bit. Got the vest. We got the uh, poncho. Semblance of a poncho. Gun holster. A couple belts. Let's make those more profound. All right. Now, um, one thing I like to do. I kind of wanted to draw the character holding a gun. But I, and I also wanted the character to hold a bottle of tequila. Just give it more of that red western look. I probably have to save that till some other time. Because I'll have to really alter his upper right arm. Hmm. What I could do instead of him holding the gun, because I have everything posi well positioned, you know. I'm going to go ahead and make that gun holder, like right here, more profound, and make it look more like a gun. And I could just go ahead and just keep this pose right here to make like he's about to make a draw, a quick draw, and shoot whoever's in front of him, you know. I figured that'd be a good, that, might, that might be a better concept than just showing the, the character holding a gun. Okay, as far as the bottle of tequila, I could go ahead and draw that. And there's also, a, I want to also draw a cigar. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I draw this, draw the bottle of tequila. And I'll just go ahead and alter his left arm. Make this a big bottle. Draw like like right here. I like that. 
All right, the challenging part is going to draw that, his arm holding it. So we're going to have to go with what we have. I'm just going to use the best of my intuition and judgment. Just going to draw. Make this the neck of the bottle just a little bit longer. Like that. Okay. I also want to draw the worm that's inside of it. We're going to draw, draw the liquid, of course, big like it's already been it's been drank. And so, so I'm going to go ahead and draw the um, worm. <laughs> Make this bottle a little longer. All right. Um, go ahead and huh, erase his arm. Then we'll somehow. Wrap it around the bottle to show that he's holding it. He's getting ready to drink it. Hmm. I could probably draw it like that. Have his claw like right here. There. Ah. Uh, well, I don't care for that, but there we go. There we go. Yeah, we could go with that. His claws right here on the other side. He's holding a bottle, okay? And I could just go draw that claw dark since his claw, since I've been swiping the one all along. He's drawn his. Claws dark. Okay, so he has his bottle of tequila right there. God's poncho. We need that cigar. We want. I want to draw. I want him smoking a cigar. So I have the cigar come out. It's a stogie. Come out like that. And of course, there will be smoke emanating from it. We're going to show the butt of it all shriveled up to show that he's been smoking it for a while. <laughs>